Welcome to CCV Knowledge Hub. I am Dr. Tanuja. Today I am going to explain about the topic Endocrine System, 10th ICSC Biology. Let's see what is Endocrine System. The Endocrine System is the collection of glands that produce hormones that regulate metabolism, growth and development, tissue function, sexual function, reproduction, sleep and mood, among other things and secrete certain chemicals called hormones. Now, what are hormones? Hormones are secretions from specific cells or glands in the body and are carried to all parts through blood and but their effect is produced in one or more specific parts that is target organ or cells only. Most hormones are secreted by special glands called endocrine glands. Endo means inside, crine means separate. Let's see general properties of hormones. Hormones are secreted from their source directly into the blood. They regulate the physiological process by chemical means. They act on target organs or cells. They are produced in very, very small quantities and are biologically very active. Their excess or deficiently both may lead to very serious consequences. Let's see four major endocrine glands like adrenals, pituitary, thyroid and pancreas. Let's see first endocrine gland adrenals. There are two parts in adrenals like adrenal cortex and adrenal medulla. First from adrenal cortex three types of hormones are secreted like mineralocorticoids, glucocorticoids and sex corticoids. Under mineralocorticoids aldosterone is the main hormone that is secreted. It regulates plasma, sodium and potassium concentrations whereas glucocorticoids like cortisol and cortisone these regulate carbohydrate, lipid and protein metabolism whereas sex corticoids they secrete adrenal androgens these are main for development of external sexual characters in males and coming to adrenal medulla it secretes adrenaline it causes stimulation of sympathetic nervous system like fight and flight hormone, adrenaline. It prepares body in any emergencies like different situations. Now, the disorders regarding adrenal glands are under secretion of these hormones causes Addison's disease and over secretion of the hormone causes adrenal virilism. Our next gland is pituitary gland. It is very important gland. The parts are anterior pituitary and posterior pituitary. And from anterior pituitary, certain main important hormones which are necessary for the body growth are secreted like growth hormone. Now, it, its under secretion causes dwarfism but over secretion causes gigantism in childhood, acromegaly in adulthood. Now, the next hormone is prolactin. It promotes lactation that is milk formation and secretion. And the next hormone is adrenocorticotrophic hormone ACTH. It stimulates secretion from adrenal cortex and thyroid stimulating hormone. It stimulates thyroxin secretion which is necessary for thyroid gland function. And the next hormone is follicle stimulating hormone FSH. In females, the growth of graphene follicles and estrogen secretion Whereas in males, spermatogenesis. And the other hormone is luteinizing hormone. In females, ovulation and maintenance of corpus luteum is main function of luteinizing hormone as well as secretion of progesterone. Now, under posterior pituitary, two hormones are released like vasopressin and oxytocin. Vasopressin, also called ADH, it increases reabsorption of water from kidneys and well as contraction of blood vessels causing rise in blood pressure. Its under secretion causes diabetes insipidus and the over secretion causes elevation of blood pressure that is hypertension. Whereas the other hormone is oxytocin. Oxytocin causes contraction of uterine muscle during childbirth. Most important organ again is thyroid. Thyroid, thyroid releases two hormones. Thyroxin and calcitonin. Thyroxin, the main function of this is promoting tissue metabolism and growth and differentiation. Under secretion causes simple goiter, cretinism in children and mixedema in adults. 
whereas over secretion causes exophthalmic goiter like eyeballs protrude protrude and increased metabolism restlessness and tremors etc whereas in calcitonin it promotes movement of calcium ions from blood to bones to means enlargement of thyroid and cretinism it's like dwarfism and mental retardation whereas myxedema means swelling of face and hands like sluggishness is pancreas pancreas three types of cells are there beta cells alpha cells and delta cells beta cells secrete insulin which is the most important hormone of the body regulation it lowers blood sugar levels its under secretion causes diabetes mellitus as we all know and alpha cells secrete glucagon it raises blood sugar level and delta cells it secretes somatostatin it inhibits the secretion of insulin and glucagon under secretion of insulin causes diabetes which is very popular and it has very high concentrations of sugars in the blood now the water is drawn into the extravascular compartment due to its high osmolarity of sugar therefore excess amount of water like loss of water through too much of urination therefore patient loses weight and even become weaker and weaker also diabetes has a very large complications like retinopathy nephropathy like that like it damages eyes and kidneys the usual treatment of this is by administering insulin insulin secretion of insulin the sugar level in the blood is lowered like it causes hypoglycemia and the brain enters into the state of coma if the level is too low so these are the four main principal endocrine glands which we discussed now if you like this video please subscribe to ccv knowledge hub thank you